Biogas is a living example of how you can turn waste into an opportunity. All around the world, in rubbish tips and uh, in agricultural settings from many, many different sources, methane gas is emerging as organic material rots. Why not harvest it? The technology for capturing uh, uh, gas from uh, uh, this garbage exists and they have been developed and they work perfectly in many countries in the world. And they are also coming into Africa. For example, uh, there are huge digesters that can be constructed to, to digest garbage from various sources, but mainly organic, uh, to, and transform them into a gas that can be used to produce electricity like in many municipalities in Europe but also to, to, to feed the grid, like uh, the, the project that have been developed in many countries in Africa. Wakati zamani atuko kwa tunayitumia, tulikuwa tunagarimika pesa mingi, kama tulikuwa tunayenda tunanunua makath, tunayenda tunanunua kuni, tunatumia firewood, ama wakati mwingine tunayenda tunatumia stima, Sikuizi stima iko beigari sana lakini tangia wakati hii biogas ilikuja tumeona mabadiliko sana ka tunapika nayo kuchungu kupasha maji moto ya kuoga tangu wakati tulipoijenga tujeshawaiona madhara yote yake bali tu ni faida This is what is now unfolding on continents like Africa and Asia it's offering employment to uh, young people and old people uh, in the harvesting of the methane, in the distribution of the gas. It's an opportunity for lifting people out of poverty in terms of raising incomes, uh, generating livelihoods, whether it be at the big industrial scale or right down at the small community level and small business level. I started constructing my first unit in 2009 as a biogas contractor. And after constructing the first unit, I was able to get other clients. And the big challenge is that in eastern area, the people are not specialized in zero grazing. But clients are switching on, on to biogas, whereby they are constructing zero grazing unit for them to get a good and a working biogas unit. Here in Kenya, just on the outskirts of Nairobi, at a place called Dagareti, there are several slaughterhouses. A lot of the animal wastes at the headwaters of the Nairobi River were being poured into the river system from those slaughterhouses. The slaughterhouses are now taking most of that waste and basically digesting it and turning it into methane gas to, in a sense, power their operations. So we're getting the benefit of power for the slaughterhouses so people can have meat, but less impact on the river system that runs through Nairobi. Let's just harvest that gas. It makes total sense. It's a way of turning waste into an opportunity, a way of delivering sustainable development, a way of envisioning parts of the green economy.